I'm hoping that I've, <laughs> yeah, that's all right, I'm just checking my audio, because last time we did this, I didn't switch off my audio. Hello, everyone. Thank you very much for joining us. Welcome to this Burr Pit live stream. How exciting. I'm doing some hauling. This is my, this is my elite dangerous thing. This is what I like doing the most, and I rarely get the chance to do it these days, so I'm actually quite excited about doing a bit of hauling, and if it's, you know, in a relatively good cause, which is, I think, Operation Ida, bless their hearts, is a marvellous thing if we can do this, and I'm quite excited about this. Uh, I've got with me today uh, Commander Primetime Casual. Good afternoon. Uh, Commander Lord Tyvin. Good afternoon. He of the Velvet Cloak. And Commander Rini. Good afternoon. And I'm all alone in my giant Type 9. You are. All al just me and my feet down there, look. It's been a while, hasn't it? It's been a while. It's been a while. It's good fun, this. I'm looking forward to this. Uh, we've got uh, Commander Lisa Zhu with us. Hello. Thank you for joining us. And we've got uh, Tater Chip. We have picture and sound. Thank you, buddy. I'm never entirely sure. Let's get this cracking in. So, uh, I did. He knows us well. He does, yeah. <laughs> cool. um, so, uh, Ida tweeted um, a few minutes ago that the, it was actually going really well, and they reckon they've got about another six to eight hours to go, and it'll be done. So, they're well inside their, their own schedule at the moment. Um, I did one run of this earlier on. I'm just I'm going to go um, to can't see the name of the system. Crow four to get some beryllium um, and bring it back here. I did one of these earlier and I made just over a million quid. So is there a list somewhere of items that they need you to buy and sell? There is. Well, uh, remind me when I get back to this station um, and I'll show you. It'll tell you what cool. what the station's Compass. got and what it currently needs. So Burr, Burr yes. basically, Tato Chip and I have just decided to. That you are going to do this entirely in FA off. All oh, right, good luck with that. Yeah. That's <laughs> 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 uh, never going to happen. Oh dear! Can you imagine? Honestly, we have to. We will have to try that one day. Actually, get me doing T nine. Let's see, I've just set myself up for something horrendous. All, there, all of us. All of us in T nines with oh, FA could off. You I think a actually design. that is a thing that we are going to do. That would be absolutely <laughs> hilarious. And we're all, I tell you what, if we all line up outside the station, all aiming at the. Um, I'm going to call it the post box just to keep my wife happy. Keep... All aimed at the post box, and then we all and go. Try and get through. And we all try and get through all at the same time. <laughs> well, that's not working out even if we are if we are FA on. So. <laughs> and if we if we can do it when there's a beluga trying to get out, that would be helpful as well. That would be good. Yeah, just just do it at, at Jack's, you know, because yeah, that's all belugas over there. Oh god, yeah, but it is, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, I've just when you had the the galaxy map of. Maybe you should open it again because just to see how many stations are actually damaged right now. Yeah. Because from where I am on distant walls, it doesn't, you know, seem so much. But there you look go. At it. Check that out. Look What's at that? It. Is that all the right? So the yellow ones with a little yeah. spanner in them are disabled at the moment and require repair or are under repair in some level. Mm. And if I can get you to the red ones, so currently down here. Right. Yeah. Got them. Those ones are on fire. That's a lot. They are hot. I as I said, that's a big amount for normal. Uh, it's well, normal. Is, normal is not a thing. A, a station being on fire is not normal. So yes, in that regard, yes, it is. That's um, yes, that is uh, even for the for the level of Thargoid attacks that we were getting. That is unusual. Yeah. As in the words yeah. of Mr. Chip, it's a mess. It's a mess. Yeah. It's quite a mess. Mm. You're not wrong, Chip. It is absolutely a mess. And you can mm. see, or you used to be able to see, actually, there was a line of damaged stations going all the way back to... Um, yeah, from the Pleiades. From to the Pleiades, the yeah. yeah. So there you go. So there's Pleiades there. There's Maya and Marope. Mm. And then you can kind of yeah, see where they start. Operation Ida already you know, fixed fixed the Pleiades, so... Yeah. 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 They have done quite some work there already. Yeah, I mean, unbelievable. I did. I did some of that. I won't gonna. I'm not gonna say I did a huge amount of it because I didn't. But I did do some of it, and my god, that was hard work. That was. I mean, then they did every single station there that was on fire, which was horrendous. Was it about 17 stations? I think they did in total, didn't they? Mm. Absolutely horrendous. So hats off, lads and lasses. Well done. Absolutely mm. amazing. Yeah, I, I think Operation Ida are absolute heroes. Okay, really. I've got a question. Oh, they are. They're amazing. In elite terms, they're absolutely extraordinary. I say it, I say it every week when I talk about them, but they're, I, I do mean it. They're absolutely amazing to have that kind of dedication to something that I know a lot of players in elite struggle with. <laughs> Long jump ranges and just hauling stuff. Yeah, I mean, 
it's not that much of a rewarding gameplay, I'd say. No, they've done it. They've done it at quite a lot of sort of personal loss credit wise as well. It's, it's quite often um, doesn't involve them making a profit at all either. So it's um it's a it, a difficult thing. Does any um I'm going to show my ignorance now. Has anybody got the slightest idea what IDA stands for? IDA stands for. Okay, good. Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> no clue at all. Tado, have you got any idea? Any idea what? Can someone tweet them and ask them for me while I'm flying? That'd be. <laughs> so if I remember correctly from when I did this before, we got three jumps out and five jumps back. Oh, okay. It's he's saying it's a mountain, in Greece. It's a mountain, mountain in Greece. Okay. That's appropriate. Mm -hmm. I never knew that. Sometimes the obvious thing, you sort of say these things all the time and never stop to question what they no. might actually stand for yeah. or the reasoning behind it. Yeah. Where is my station? There it is. I do like my T9. Mount Ida is the highest mountain on Crete with uh, 2,456 meters and is one of the sacred mountains of. Uh, of the Greek mythology for the uh, mountain of the goddess. Oh, there you go! Mm. Brilliant, thank you! The Greek titaness Rhea. Nice! Ah, brilliant! Okay! You're so lucky having Google. It's the uh, it's the mountain in Greece <laughs> that's most that. frequently attacked by aliens. Did you? Did you I know knew that, that off the top of my head. Yeah, Did absolutely. You? No, you no Googling whatsoever. No, you How long did you know? <laughs> <laughs> He has to be careful right now that it doesn't pierce pierce his uh, screen. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's cool, though. Good name. Very appropriate. Yeah, absolutely appropriate. So, how far do you have to fly? To do this, so yes. I've got three trips to the station that I'm going to now, and then uh, which is where I'm at now, and then I've got uh, a couple of minutes in super cruise, doing about seven and a half thousand light seconds. Um, no. How much cargo can you actually take on board? About, hang on, 700 odd tons. Hang on, let's have a look. There we go, 752. Full cargo racks then, 720. Yeah, 752. Yeah, 750, yeah. So a fair bit. Not too shabby, to be honest. I could do more if I wanted to run without um, a docking computer, don't hate me. Um, and if I wanted to run uh, without shields, I could carry an awful lot more, but... Me running without shields is never no, going to end well. No, it's not a good idea. Particularly on a live stream, yeah. And the, I did, I did look at taking the docking computer out actually because I honestly don't need it, particularly for this run. Um, but um, it only gave me four, uh, four cargo slots in return, so it just wasn't worth doing. Not worth it. No. Mm. Yeah, that's my 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 concession to being an old man who likes to sit back with his tea on the desk and uh, with his feet on the desk and drink tea. <laughs> He is necessary. Absolutely. Yeah, and sitting back when you're doing this kind of thing is necessary as well. I mean, when yeah. I did the uh, Robigo runs for money, I just did the same docking computer and mm. let it dock and, and during that time uh, drink something, eat some chocolate. Look at Discord. Yeah. Look at, yeah. <laughs> Look at Discord. Look at Twitter or <laughs> you name it. Speaking yeah, of Discord. Look at, look at Discord, look at Twitter, fly into a sun, have some tea. Yeah, yeah fly into a sun. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, speaking of Discord. Experience I'll... the nice space weather. After this is done, uh, I need to put a photo on Discord uh, for everybody to see because um, I am having a birthday tomorrow. And Ooh. and really, I always do a themed cake. As is the tradition, yeah. As is the oh, I'm being interdicted. How exciting! I wonder if they'll actually turn up. Nope. 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 Um, nope. And as it, as is a tradition in this household, Commander Rini always makes. Oh, he's turned up now. Now is I'm it? in a now I'm in an unarmed hauler. So honestly, <laughs> how many times did I get interdicted on Friday night? Was it like fifteen? In yeah. a horribly beweaponed anaconda. Oh, good heavens! And they never turn up. Um, uh, there you go, so, on yeah. my way. So the themed birthday cake is so, Burp It. Yes, so it's a Burp It themed birthday cake, yeah. Yes. And I blame Primetime Casual completely. <laughs> <laughs> what have I done? I think
think that's only fair. <laughs> Loop of shame. Actually, I think up. it might be aggregate. Actually, might be responsible for this one. This is turning a bit into like like Damas Corbius or starting to blame me for everything. Well, in wow. in Escorbius's defence, he has never actually done anything ever, whereas you are generally quite unpleasant. So. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say, yeah. most of the time, you're actually right. Yeah. <laughs> I actually, I might take it back, because I actually think Aggregate Chip might be um, responsible for this one. As it was my birthday tomorrow, I did, I did mention to Reed, she didn't she didn't laugh, but I did mention to Reed earlier that as it's my birthday, I can put whatever I want on the telly, and I was going to put Anchorman on, but I don't think no. she's going <laughs> to... She still won't let me get away with it. <laughs> not fair. Taylor's <laughs> asking if you've got pack hounds. Packhounds on my cow. No, I have got access to packhounds, but I don't have them on this cow currently. No, no, I have got because I, I once tried using it as a. Um, I, I experimented with mines to see if I could turn it into a bomber. So it's actually got. <laughs> so it's actually got shed tons of mine launchers on it. So if I did genuinely get into trouble and I was running away from someone, I could always drop loads and loads of mines on them and see what happens. But better question: How fast is your cow? Oh, not at all. 300, I think it maxes out at. I think that's quite nice. Is that quite good? Yeah, yeah it's, it's faster than my exploration ship. Hmm. Yeah, and faster than mine as well. Oh, so okay. We don't have to be ashamed for that. It's terrible, isn't it? I'd love to be able to tell you that. I, I couldn't tell you why it's that fast. I just know what I've got access to and what. And what um, at the time when I was messing around with engineering and I happened to be in this ship, that's how rubbish I am. I uh, I just kind of, I knew what resources I had access to and what I'd already unlocked. So this ship at that particular moment got it, but I couldn't tell you what I did to it. I know the shields are engineered on it. Um, You've so got to do some engineering. Yeah, yeah, I've really got to get into Talk engineering. Yeah, we were, we were nattering about that this morning, weren't we? Yeah, yeah. I've got to, got to get into my engineering properly, especially my um, my anaconda. Really, really needs that. Mm. Yeah, it's a bit what frustrating. Do you, what, do you want to make, uh, what do you want to engineer on your anaconda? Do you want just to make it more survivable for, for survivability is my problem? Yeah, yeah. I mean the, the the lasers and the um, machine guns on it are are um, multi cannons on it are, uh, are quite heavily engineered anyway. In the case of the lasers, I think they're engineered to the most of the, the maximum that they can be complete with experimental effects and stuff but I never got round to doing uh, any survivability stuff on it if my memory serves so that's that's my my real issue it's only re really recently that since um, Venom our son went and um, engineered the conkers off of his ship what's he got remind me Ricky remember um, Vulture the Vulture yeah. yeah the Vulture yeah he absolutely engineered the conkers off it like did it properly because he's you know 16 and he's got a bit of time on his hands and a absolutely oh my god it's nuts it's yeah. absolutely it's, I think it proved it last night yeah it's, it's practically unkillable mm. challenge accepted but yeah it's <laughs> beryllium beryllium there we go so, what do you what do you actually need to repair a station? Is the is it different for each station, or is it a common a common materials for for everyone? Um, my understanding is that it's the quantities are different for each station, I believe. But Ida Ida could probably tell you better than I can. But I I think um, it's generally the same stuff, but the you know the the quantities are subject to RNGs, as I'd imagine. Mm -hmm. uh, I. I once heard or read some, somewhere that it also had something to do with how many people are rescued from the station while it's burning, but I'm not yeah. sure if that's I've really heard, yeah, I've like heard that. this. Or... Yeah, yeah I've, heard, I've heard that as well. Yeah, I don't know how true that is, but it would be nice if that was the case. I think, I think, I think either are of the belief that that's the case because they're, they're pushing at the moment, they're, tr they're really trying to push the, the three disciplines. Um, hauling, defending, and rescue. Mm. And if you know, if 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 rescue was of no value to them whatsoever, I can't imagine they'd be telling everybody to go and do it. So, so basically, yeah. if you, if you rescue more people from the station, you need less materials to repair. Hey, Tato, thanks for the host, mate. Uh, yeah, you. Um, yeah, if you, the more people that get rescued, the the less materials you need to conduct the rest of the repairs. Yeah, that's my understanding. All right. Be nice if that was true. Mm. 
So, so basically, rich stations will need less materials because people there pay better and get rescued. <laughs> yeah, I sp yeah, I suppose so. Yeah. Long and short of it, yeah. isn't that? Or, or people are generally explosive, and the more of them you get off the station, the less damage is done. <laughs> people are explosive. It's our thing. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, did you hear, by the way, I was bitterly disappointed, right? I looked on Galnet News, li literally just before we went live, I saw on Galnet, you know there was that station, uh, I can't remember where it was, but there were a bunch of um, uh, religious maniacs holed up in there with a nuclear weapon. Oh, that's the one we went to. Yeah, yeah, they, yeah. yeah it's been, it's, it's been the, the siege has been quashed and the guy in charge has been killed and they're not going to blow the station up. Oh. Yeah, that was my reaction. We're awful, aren't we? That was my reaction as well. No. The Federal Navy actually got their behinds up and did something? Uh, or Well, apparently the, the Federal Intelligence Agencies, I want to say, had people embedded with the, um, uh, ah. with the cult and uh, they seized their opportunity and, and put some... Put a, oh, God, here we go. I'm being interdicted again. And put, put a bullet in the bloke's brain. Um, oh, before he sense. before he could detonate the weapon, so. And that's why you use dead man switches for that. Um, yeah, that's true. We're being attacked. Shall I drop some mines? Drop mines. Drop, drop the mines. Drop them. Do it. Pop a heat sink. Drop some chaff. <laughs> Super jump. <laughs> Super jump. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we are very helpful with combat. We are all extremely expert <laughs> combat pilots yeah. here. I launched Pure loads X. of mines, none of them hit him. Oh good, I got a missile Fair coming enough. in now. More mines. I can't believe it. See, it's obviously a multi-crew thing, so as soon as you're a multi-crew, the ships don't turn up when you're on your Todd. It does, actually, do you know what? It does seem... It could be. Do you know what? We should test that. As we should test that. that is. We'll yeah. test that out. Yeah. yeah. Who, wants yeah. To, who wants to hop in? Uh, I, I can do it, but I'd have in. to get into the... Operation Ida private group. Oh, uh, I think yeah, I think it's automatically accepting, but I could be wrong. Yeah, it was this morning, wasn't it? Yeah. So I just have to look for the group in the games? Yeah, literally just go into groups um, and type in the commander name Operation Ida and it, it should be there. Yeah, I... Potato chip, I think running into your own minds, that would be a very burpid thing to do. Yeah, I'm not going to say that I've done that. We have, have, haven't you? I have done that. <laughs> yes, I, I have done that. Surprised. Yeah, I okay, have done Okay, I that. requested to join the group. And... Okay, so if you, if you come out of the game to the main menu and then go back in private group, it should be there for you. It was for me this morning anyway, but unless they've changed there. Okay, yeah, yeah, I got the invite. Okay, I'm just hyperspacing at the moment. Go with me a second. Hyperspacing. Hyperspacing. Hyperjumping through space. Doing a witch space. Excellent. It actually makes my teeth hurt when you say the witch space I will news. get you all converted. No, you won't. Not that one. <laughs> Not that one. You've already got Aggie saying loads of rubbish that comes out of you, haven't you, honestly? <laughs> he folded He folded like a napkin, didn't he? He, he? he was like... quick. He was good. <laughs> Is that you in Tives? Yeah, it's still loading my SRV right now. Oh, okay. Just... I'll, I'll tell you once I'm in. Okay, buddy. Okay, but you need beryllium? And what are the other materials? Okay, burr, yep. I'm in. You can invite me. I'll wait till you're in before I jump, in case it gets its knickers in a twist. <laughs> Tater chip engages lurk mode. <laughs> Hello, Tives. And I'm in. Yeah. 
Next. Are you sitting on Burr's lap? <laughs> <laughs> at least do that at least once a day. I am not, as a matter of fact. That's a surprise. There he is, yeah, Mr. Really is. Shades. Look at these oh, shades. Oh, looking cool. Checking me out. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so how does how does this work? How do when do you know or do you actually know that you've delivered enough of one kind of material? You can station? you can see it um, on the there's like a there's Is there a, like a progress bar. Yeah, well, not anything nearly as neat as that. The, mm. If you look at the news on the you know when you go to station services, mm. um, there's a news thing at the bottom that no one ever looks at. Well, if you look there. <laughs> um, there's a um, there's a little the top news story for the stations that have got their knickers in a twist is um, help or something along those lines um, and if you go into that then it tells you how much is needed and how much how much they've already got or how, you know how that seems quite a, convoluted a percentage I'll, sh I'll show you when we get there I'll show yeah. you yeah please do um, because I would have expected it to be a bit more prominent you know. You'd like a nice progress bar, wouldn't you? And it does. I agree. It needs to be kind of the first thing you see when you when you go to station services. It needs to go. We've got our knickers in a twist. Mm. Any chance you've got some beryllium in your back pocket or something like that? Yeah. Yeah. I'm expecting even, to see a Tado now. Even visible on the, the on the on the gal map actually. Okay, I've got a pirate threatening me, by the way. So yeah, okay. we have yeah. him hot on our heels. But I took the freedom to jump into gunner roll, by the way. Okay, mate, knock yourself out. Yeah. And Here I'll we go. see if I can go do go. something. Okay, we're being interdicted. Let's see if oh, he yeah. drops in this time, yeah? Okay, yeah, so if he drops in, that disproves our Martin crew theory. Okay, he's not here. That's what it is. <laughs> is he not? Nope. No. That's, that's certainly an interesting <laughs> result, isn't it? That's interesting. I've been interdicted twice, got two but. people arrived twice. All, all last night I had multi crew and no one arrived. Back with someone in multi crew and no one's coming. It's so. beneficial to us right now. Yeah, it is. So either we found a bug or all the NPCs in the game don't like A, my wife, B, Germans. <laughs> <laughs> I'll probably go for the first option. Quite possibly a bug. Oh, that's suspect. really interesting then. That yeah, is. because we've been. I mean, this has been what since the last release. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So we'll, it's, it's yeah. Quarter four update. Yeah. It yeah. Has, isn't so it? we'll have to jump on the. Um, uh, do we report that bug or do we leave it? Yeah, no. Convenient? Well, no. We'll keep, we'll do it. We'll do a few more tests and see if it if it if it if it you know if it pans out that that's the case. And but yeah, we'll we'll we'll, we'll report it on the new bug reporting system that well, I. Nobody's turned up an interdiction since we multi crewed. No. It's quarter four, so. No. I reported on this week's Witch Base News. <laughs> Ahoy hoy. Ahoy hoy. <laughs> nice planet. It's a nice planet. Looks quite yeah. cold though. That North Pole seems some um, big. Or is that just me? No, that's that's probably about standard for your North Pole in it, actually. Yeah, I, I think it should cool be place. standard on Earth as well if we hadn't uh Yeah, if we weren't messing well, it up, yeah. Blitz the whole planet. Yeah. That's Brexit causing that, that is. <laughs> Hashtag blame Brexit. Yeah. Yeah, 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 definitely. Absolutely. So where are you on your way to now? You're back I'm to the... dropping in any second at the station that, that actually wants repairing, and I'm half expecting to see a tater chip there, I've got to be honest. <laughs> he knows where you are. Yeah, there we go. So if you if you look on the stream, really, I'll try and get your look as I go in. This one's, this one's damaged, but not on fire. Okay. So it's all scaffolding and... Inside as well is all smoky and dusty and stuff. Yeah, happening. and you can see that habitat ring there is a bit messed up. Yeah. 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 I do love what they've done with the models for you. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Oh, you know that? Um, that yeah. So that capital ship fight we were in last night, speaking of models. Um, so we had two capital ships last night wailing on each other and or me, an aggregate. Mm. Um, uh, Venom was was in on that fight. He was, he did the whole thing in VR. Said it looked absolutely amazing. Attention, Commander. He looks a bit disheveled by the end of it, though. <laughs> yeah, he came, all, he came in all bleary eyed. His hair was all over the place. <laughs> he looked like he'd had a great time, but <laughs> he looked like he'd been to a party. Yeah. <laughs> Capital ship party. 
landing gear deployed. They need to get a fan system sorted out for VR. <laughs> Did you just get <laughs> There's a wall there. Oh. <laughs> That's my I meant cool. to do that. <laughs> mm -hmm. And go forward. Yeah, and I was going go. to say, a duck and computer is very enthusiastic this time. <laughs> yeah. They don't work in these in these stations anyway. When oh, they're when because they not on not on no just because this because bits of this station are currently offline. So ah, well that makes it a bit tricky. Yep. Right, let me show let me show you that galnet thing. Right. So here we go. So here's uh, you'll see where the light bar is when you when the stream catches up. Yeah. So the yeah. okay. uh, where the light bar is at the time. There's the galnet news thing that no one goes into, and then the top story on there is relief requested. Wow, a Jesus! Right, beryllium was at about six percent this morning when I first looked at it. And so that's all you've got to go on. So that's the top up. Yeah, so, so you've already anymore. completed um, gallium. Ah. Are these always materials you can just buy? Uh, for the most part, I'm going to say yes. I think some of them are slightly rarer than others, but you know we're in the bubble, so none of it's unobtainable. Yeah, but it's not like something you have to have to mine for, for example. I don't know. No, I don't think so. Right. Again, that's my understanding, but I think a lot of things are true. It doesn't make them true. That's true. Right. So I've got to do a thing here as well if you're going to do this properly. So 752 tons of Burra helium, thusly, and then I nip across to Ida's, right, you have to. Ida's Discord, yeah, and just report it yeah. quick in a custom-built channel. Because you know, it's very interesting to see how this all works. You know, repairing a station and finding out what you need and how much of it. Because yeah, yeah, you don't really, um, you know. Get the story behind you. Just read. Oh, Operation Ida is repairing this That's station. That's right. That station. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. By what the way, it goes into it. Fifteen twenty-three. Yeah. It kind of puts it in context, with it? Fourteen twenty-three UTC, isn't it? Thereabouts. Because that list of materials was quite long. I thought it was like just like you know one or two or three materials and uh, resources. But you need <clears> lots <throat> of stuff. Mm. Yeah, it's quite a list. Be nice if we got beryllium done while we're on stream. It's it's well on target. I have to say. And they've got to get silicon. You know, they've got to get all of those. Yes. Okay. Yeah. And then what happens? The um, then classes are repaired. The station the stay station. stays in the state that it's in until um, Thursday. Oh, okay. When the when the universe reboots. Excellent. We switch it on and off again. Yeah, the off universe again. goes off and on again. And then it's all fixed. Yeah, and then it's Excellent. and then theoretically the station should be back online. Right. Um, uh, yes, mate. May I ask you how you got that lightning lighting decal? Uh, da, 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 da. I'm trying to think what one you're thinking of. What does it look like? Uh, it's it looks like the Frontier logo somehow, and it has. The letters FX on it. Oh right, that was from the Frontier Expo. Oh, okay, oh, yeah. yeah, makes sense. Got about that. Yeah, that was a yeah Frontier Expo. Got a paint job. Everybody got a goodie bag, didn't they? Yeah, yeah, got a paint job and a few yeah a few bits. Yeah, yeah. Oh I god, I, oh god, I was just about to say yeah. We want an Expo next oh, year, don't we? Oh, Please or this year, frankly. Yeah, that'd be nice. I honestly think like that. Well, the tail end of this year, if it follows the pattern of the last one, it'll be the tail end of this year because. They're going to want to push the 2020 stuff. Equally, that it'd be more logical to be next year when prior to launch. I don't know because they did because FX the last one was a was in 2017 and it was talking about stuff that happened at the end of 2018. Oh, was that? Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, they want to keep interest up. In yeah. A long time. Okay. Yeah, and plus they've got a. I think they, haven't they got a game launching later this year, and no yeah. one knows what it is yet. So. Yeah. That'd be fun. We need to have a burp it meet up. Oh, wouldn't that be Absolutely. amazing? Oh, wouldn't that just be yeah. amazing? We were saying this morning, could you imagine we'll all be greeting each other with 707 and 707 <laughs> salutes? We'll look like the local yeah, doing that strange, uh, <laughs> Walk like an Egyptian. 707 thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I honestly think I'd cry real burr tears, honestly. <laughs> it would just be brilliant. Drive we'll all just get arrested for public disturbance. <laughs> yeah, almost certainly. <laughs> Last time, well, last time I was the, sorry, last time I was there because there's been several. There hasn't. There's been one that yeah. when I went last time there was um, 
uh, all the guys from Canon, I assume it was Canon anyway, were walking around in lab coats with clipboards and Brilliant. yeah, <laughs> yeah, it looked fantastic. Yeah, a hut and orbit all had a stand, and yeah, it was it was great, really good. Yeah, it looked good. And David Braben looked at me. <laughs> <laughs> he liked one of my tweets. <laughs> Yeah, all right. Did, know, all right. <laughs> Just because you're interested, you take that great pictures, idiot. Yeah. <laughs> well deserved. Yeah, that was amazing. You must have been. In, oh my god. You, I bet you lost your lunch, didn't you? Something like that. <laughs> That's nice. Nice that they're involved. Don't anybody let me run out of fuel, by the way. I managed to remember to refill that time, but yeah, okay. That was that was your that was your that was your silent intake of breath. Of now, nah, I'm gonna let you run out of fuel. <laughs> <laughs> Just checking how much fuel you actually have. <laughs> I'm good at the moment. So actually, you don't have a fuel scoop on this one. No. No. So what do you have to do? Just top up at the station? Yeah, yeah, I just remember to top up at the station. Top up at the petrol station. Yes. Which, in theory, should never let you run out because you just one jump between the, or two jumps between the two stations. Yeah, it should be fine. I mean, even on the way back, five jumps is, is not going not gonna to empty the tank by any stretch. But I think if I, do a, if I go there and come back and then leave again, that I will run out of fuel, I think. I almost ran out of fuel once during the Rubigo passenger missions. I did actually run out of fuel during the Rubigo passenger missions. It was missions. the one and only time, wasn't it? Who, me? Yeah. No, I run out since then. Have yeah. you? Yeah. I've done it. Well, I called the fuel rats once, and they were amazing and turned they were up. very good. Yeah, they turned up, like, literally in, mi in, a, in a, inside a minute, didn't they? Yeah, but you were only just at the station rata, weren't you? No, no. I was down in Rubigo. That's quite a way outside oh, yeah. the bubble. Oh, yeah. I'll let you off. Um, thanks. Um, yeah, they turned up. They turned up super quick. And then the, the time after that, I thought I just can't. I just can't. Call. I know they. I know they love this sort of thing, and it's what and it's their game. But I just couldn't call them again, so I detonated. I was just, just too ashamed. Go on then. Yeah, what did you How do? How many Prime? times have you done it, Prime? Come on, Prime. I don't want to have it afterwards. Never actually. Have you not? You've never run no, out of fuel. I... Almost, almost ran out of fuel numerous times during the first speed bolt and wow. during the distant bolt, but uh, never quite entirely. Okay. Almost was able to, to make it back to the next fuel stop. Nice. I swear to God, I've done it like 50 times. Those are the times that I remember, but I swear to God, I've done it no, loads of times. I don't think you've done it that many times. How many times have you done it, Tyson? Yeah, I've been playing for five years, right? Really. Uh, <laughs> never as well, funny enough, I remember that one time when I was pretty new into the game mm. and I did a long run through Super Cruise, I was down to 5% or something. Okay. Lisa Zhu saying she's, I... she's never run out of fuel either, over 5,000 hours of flight time. Oh, respect. <sighs> That's what you call paying help. attention. Yeah, I can tell you what's quite dis disconcerting is when you're in the middle of a speedball run, like going 4,000, uh, 4, 5,000 meters per second, and you su uh, suddenly get the warning, fuel reserves 10%. Oh, oh my, yeah. Oh. I'd love to see the fuel rats make that one. That'd be brilliant. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Can you intercept me? <laughs> yeah. Match my speed. Yeah. Have you, you have Match you... my speed or, you know, come down to this planet. It's only got 10 G. Have you ever oh, tried doing anything damn. ridiculously silly while you're in Super Bowl? In Super Bowl, I was going to say, in Speed Bowl. Like, have you ever tried? I don't know, launching Olympic or firing missiles, or have you ever tried anything like that? We've, Tyven, uh, with, with Tyven, we have done launching a super launched fighter. Oh yeah. my god! How did that go? Quite well, actually. Uh, yeah. Did it we... survive? No, it it didn't. I think. No, it didn't. But it yes. got quite a nice speed boost, and yep. with this prime, uh, <laughs> came in first for the distant bowl. Well, for the ship launch fighter. Subcast. Yeah, yes. in the wow. ship fighter category. <laughs> wow, using prime as a booster. <laughs> That's kind of cool. I love how you say, how did that yeah, go? And you, and you say quite well. And then I say, did it survive? No, your understanding of quite well and my understanding of quite well <laughs> seem to be quite different. 
Uh, uh, this was Tywin was literally firing a primetime casual at a planet. <laughs> I like it. Yeah, because I, like I said, it. okay, we, we can go a kilometer lower and a kilometer lower, and then we were at seven kilometers altitude or something. <laughs> Which would have been fine, but you know, the launching sequence of the it, ship launch yeah. starter is so long. Yeah, stuff yeah, happens like quite the quickly. I actually yeah. went, I went down the ramp, it was like five kilometers off the ground. Ooh. Yeah, yeah. And, well, and Tyvon didn't didn't pitch up, so I was launching yeah. down at a downward angle towards the planet. <laughs> yeah, nice. <laughs> Brilliant. If you want to do that, that you'd that have to post. pitch up. Yeah, next time. For a yeah. bit. Yeah, I was going to say, when you're speed bowling, I'd imagine you haven't got a lot of time and it all happens quite quickly. Except the stuff you want to happen quickly. Yeah. Uh, you the, the, how much the you can bowl do. was much more relaxed than speedball 2 i have to yeah. say okay because for speedball 2 you had bomb belly prospect there and you had to fly through this pretty small zone yeah yes it was very tough you had to be the fastest when going through there yeah certain height certain speed with this bowl it was just okay you go faster and faster and faster mm. and in the end you we're going extremely flat, mm. almost level flight, mm. and just made it longer and longer and longer and got a little bit faster one meter per second at a time. Right. You know, I, I remember Speed Bowl 2 very well. I still show, I still have the mental scars from that. Scarred. Honestly. That was fun though, what a weekend. That was mad. Yeah, absolutely. <clears throat> yeah. It's okay, I'll just put in a, a link to the uh, Tyvin and my run. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Yeah, do oh, it. Oh, that. But wasn't that the run where you did, where we did it in your ship? And I was just. Yeah, but it's it's better than nothing because. Yeah. Yeah, the, the run with the Anaconda with the ship launched fighter would have been interesting as well. Yeah. But uh, I don't think I recorded this. Yeah. So how long until you two yeah. are at Beagle Point now? How's Distant Worlds mm. going? How long until you get there? Can't be too long now. No, I, I think it's it. three more waypoints or something, because one yeah. one will be a very, very long leg of the journey with 17,000 light years or so. Oh my... Oh. And uh, two weeks for that. Mm. I was going to say, you haven't got a week just to do that, have you? That's still quite a lot for, for two weeks, though, isn't it? That's, that's a, yeah. Mm. Yeah, it's almost double the distance. Usually we have between five and five and seven thousand. Right. Yeah, right. Between right. four and a half and six, seven thousand light years. That's about the it. The last one was quite short, but you know, it had the permit locks. Yeah. Yeah. So did that slow you down significantly? Or it's just shit. Uh, it does. depends on how patient you are. I yeah, think. true. Yeah, it it goes on your nerves. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's yeah. what it does. It doesn't yeah. slow you down that much because at least jump range, in just you just a jump like two or three jumps in a direction. Let's say ninety degrees. Uh, away from your course that you are on to get uh, to then you can plot a course that uh, goes by the permit locked sector mm. oh yeah that's the that's the the decal just for the stream and just showing the decal that Tyvin was talking it's about nice yeah. Yeah. yeah it's emissive as well which is nice mm. well, I have the, the Hutton orbital truckers decal Oh yeah, you have, haven't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've got a Canon one, which I'm quite proud of as well, which Ooh, is nice. nice. Hmm. Uh, is it decal or decal or decal? Well... I, I call them decals. I call right. them decals, I think. Decals, if I remember to. Okay. But I don't know if that's necessarily right. Uh, I know there's decal and decal, isn't there? I've always called them decals, but... Yeah. Okay, Tado's saying decal. Yeah. Decal. Yeah. Isn't he American? 
Well, yes, yeah, but like you're that. German. Oh. We don't hold that against you. <laughs> <laughs> Never. God, he's unpleasant, isn't he? <laughs> he's harsh, isn't he? Very harsh. <laughs> Yeah, that, um, I, I, sorry, go on, mate, go on. I mean, I could have said, Taylor, shut up, I'm asking the native speakers. But... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, we invented the language and we're not sure. That tells you everything you need to know. There's quite a lot we're not sure about in our language. Yeah. Oh, Ree, I put a, um, before I forget, because mm -hmm. uh, because uh, tithing questioned what on earth I was doing as well, I put a system in the, um, in the scratch pad in Discord mm -hmm. uh, today. Just because it looks, it looked to me, I had a real cursory look when I jumped in, but it's in the bubble and it looks like it's got three stars right on top of the jump point and then landable planets and gas giants and stuff mm -hmm. like that as well. So it looked like it might make quite good photography. Hurrim Faxi. There's the Johnny. Yeah, that one. Yes. Yes. Oh, that's why I promised I Mordecai <laughs> Chung has just <laughs> yeah. subscribed. Thank you very much, buddy. Appreciate that. Thank you. Welcome to the stream. Yeah, that definitely sounds worth worth a look. So did I hear you right? So two weeks till Beagle Point and then you're coming home. Is that what I heard? That's what I heard. That's what I heard. No, that's, that's not what we said, no. Yeah, OK. Oh, but that's what you're saying now, so that's it's good. worth a okay. try. Two weeks to Beagle Point, then home. Good. Then home. Good. I think it's planned for the 10th of May. What, to come the arrival home? at Beagle Point or something, something around that uh, date. It is, and then there's still the journey back. Yeah, but you can punt that, can't you? You can just, <laughs> you can just jump, 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 jump. I'm, hours I, I miss Burr, and you'll be home, won't you? <laughs> right? That's what we agreed, wasn't it? Right, guys? I'm so okay, Burr. lonely. <laughs> Burr, let, let's let's make a deal. Uh -huh. I'll do that when you are the whole time in Discord with me and in multi crew. Yeah. Definitely. Oh. Then we can do this. Oh, he drives a hard bargain. Mm. On the plus side, it would get me out of work, so. A marathon jumpathon, bucket ball. You're on! No, you're not. <laughs> marathon jumpathon, I like the sound of that. We're doing, I'll tell you what, when you do get back, we are doing SRV footage a go go. We're doing. SRV racing. Yeah, we're doing lots of oh. SRV stuff at the moment, and obviously because people are on an event, so we can't kind of push them and organize them in places where we need them to be but you lot we don't mind pushing around at all so It'd when you fun. get back we're going to make you look spectacular in a little car yeah base jumping that's already on the bucket list yeah and very high up amongst other nonsense yeah see Taylor saying two weeks get it done yeah I'm with Taylor get her done did I do that right did that sound American get her done how am I doing Taylor is that good <laughs> Just as horrendous as your fake German accent. Ma, get my gun, I done got me a city boy. <laughs> is that right? Is that right? My fake German accent's brilliant, don't you think? I think your German's quite good. Yeah. It's fantastic. I always know when you're talking prime. I learned it from James okay, Bond well, movies. Well, we, we could actually put your German skills to a test. Uh oh. Oh, God. Oh, we still no. have quite a few oh, aces up Oh, no. Our sleeve, Not I this believe. nonsense oh, God, again. We, isn't the quiz. Got Funny thing, I have this list open, you know. Oh, okay, okay. We will, we will, we will jump through your hoops. We will perform your funny little monkey tests on one condition. You come I, I want you to say live on stream right now. No, Mr. Bond, I expect you to die. <laughs> <laughs> that's Both of fair. you. Is that what Gary Oldman says? No, it's a James no, Bond. No, that's thing, what Gerd Fröber says in Goldfinger. See, even see, oh, I love the way so you said good. that. By the way, I'm not even going to attempt really to say Gerd Fröber. Is that right, Gerd Fröber? Uh, almost. Almost. Good enough. <laughs> Do you think we've we've got them off the plot of doing the quiz? No. We've, we've dropped the Not scent. for a moment. No. <sighs> no, Mister Burr. We expect you to die. That was good, wasn't it? That, <laughs> that was, was really good. I actually weed a little bit. That was quite upsetting. Well done. <laughs> Who? Uh, Tato's put. Look up Larry the Cable Guy. Larry the Cable Guy. <laughs> That sounds like it should be an offence, looking up Larry the Cable Guy. <laughs> Look up Larry the Cable Guy. I can hear Prime doing it already. Should we do that? Do we trust Tato enough to do that? We do. Okay. Oh dear. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not doing that. I'm not passing that. <laughs> 
Apologies to the stream, I'm having to look up my nose at the moment because I did a loop of shame and now I'm trying to see where I'm heading to. It's a good thing your webcam has such a small picture. Yeah. 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 I don't imagine that's a pleasant sight by any stretch of the imagination. So, all right. Hurry up for a little quiz. Uh oh. I Come thought we'd forgotten. In. No. <laughs> Uh, you got me for about another 15, 20 minutes, I reckon, Tato. Probably one more run. Mm, sounds about right. Come on, then. Come on, then. Actually, I'm losing, so we need to do this quiz. Cause I yeah. need to, Wait, I need can to... you say that again? Because I want to record it. <laughs> <coughs> I didn't say anything. Hey, loser! That's what I heard. <laughs> so you, can, you can clip it already on Twitch. Yeah, somebody clip that for me, will they? <laughs> so basically, basically Burr's leading 3 to 2. Burr's leading Whoa. 3 to 2. That's painful. So Come on. 3 to 2. So that's 3 to me, and that's 2 to you, which means you are a loser. Okay, I'm on form today. I'm going to get this. I'm going to gonna... nail this right, today. Yeah. Come on. Okay. Get Again, for, for the stream, what we're doing now is I'm uh, pronouncing one German word and then giving the birds at the two <laughs> options what it means. And they have to guess the right one. All right, first right. word. Spiegelei. Oh, I like the word. Yeah. Is it A, A, a slightly oval mirror, or B, a fried egg? Wait, hang on, say the first one again, because Elite was speaking at me. Uh, Spiegel Eye, is it A, a slightly oval oval uh, mirror, or B, a fried egg? Is it the Spiegel Eye Network? Or is it, or I was going to say, is it, <laughs> I was going to say, or is it Eagle Eye with Spurt on the beginning? <laughs> <laughs> is it Prime? Is it, is it, is it? <laughs> You can hear the disgust in his breathing, can't you? <laughs> oh, that was my favourite word ever. Oh, I love it when he's disappointed in us. It's just... <laughs> is it prime? Is it can Spiegel? We both get a point for that? I'm guessing B. I'm going for the egg. Tato's going for A. Um, oh, Tato's probably right. I think it's I. Honestly, I think it's I. <laughs> I think it's I, uh, A. I was going to say I. I think it's I think it's A. <laughs> well, Potato, I think you were distracted because I know you're learning German. You were, were distracted by oh. the Spiegel in it. Uh, Spiegel means mirror. Come on, tell me I'm oh. right. Tell me I'm right. Tell me I'm right. It is actually a fried egg. Oh, <laughs> no. Rini, um, Woohoo! Score the equalizer. The score. Equalizer. Yeah, but you know. The Burrett is going to win. Don't mean nothing, does it, eh? Some people are on the pitch, they think it's all over. It is now! Sorry, I didn't want to bring that up again. But... So I'm actually putting the words in chat now so people can read it as well. Right. Spiegel. The next one. That's a good word. Uh, is Hassliebe. Hassliebe. Okay. Is it A? The dichotomy of different points of view causing both positive and negative reactions to a certain thing or person, often leading to the inability of making a decision regarding the object. Uh, you lost me wow. after the first sentence, but go on. <laughs> or B, a feeling of passionate love during spring, often leading to a noticeable peak in numbers of births later in the year. Oh my oh, god! I so hope it's B. I so hope yeah. it's B. <laughs> right, maybe you could put these two um, sentences into chat as well. I think either, either way, B. the theme of that is just brilliant. The fact you even type that up it's quite impressive i'm saying b so much rabbit much like rabbits yeah oh rabbits it's hats for rabbits no. I'm, I'm i'm a chip i want it to be b, b. you want it to be b yeah because right. there's rabbits in it and uh, uh Burr, your decision was i'm going b yeah oh no you guys go the same good luck with that i said we b first we so don't you... do <laughs> it is a obviously oh. <laughs> oh we all lost that one yeah Oh. First time you. So, did you actually think up B? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. That makes it even funnier. <laughs> yeah. Honestly. I think a, the definition is very. We actually. Tyvan uh, Tyven, Tyven and A. Dear Lord. Tyvan <laughs> and I had actually to look it up. The, the proper you? definition of it, yes. 
Yeah. I can't believe such a small word can mean all that. God, the Germans are hard. Okay. Good luck learning the language, Tado. Yeah. Right, come on. Have have we got, right, we've got an equalizer. We've got a, a decider here. Right. List of three. Um, let's do it. Um, come on, I'm going to win. I've got to win this. <laughs> <laughs> Let's let's do this one. Right. Solidaritätszuschlag. I'm a what? A what? <laughs> what did you call me? That's a bit <laughs> rude, isn't it? Solidaritätszuschlag. He's making it up. That's a made-up word. There's no way that's a that's real okay. word. Solidaritätszuschlag. Brilliant. Right. A. A special tax only paid by employees working in regions of the former Federal Republic of Germany and used for subsidizing former businesses in the former German Democratic Republic. Right. Or B. Colloquialism for getting allowed to play at the restaurant after a decisive game of football when wearing the colors of the local club and being visibly a supporter of the team. That's not a thing. Getting a larger plate at a restaurant after a decisive game of football when wearing the colours of a local club and being... Yeah, it's got solidarity. Okay, so is it going to be tax or football? What's the word again? Spoken Jürgen Jürgen. Solidaritätszuschlag. That could be misdirection though. Yeah, but he likes a misdirection. He's quite, a he's quite treacherous. See, I'm still with Lisa. That I'm still trying to work out what dichotomy means as well, but hey-ho, let's move on. <laughs> I'm really sorry about this, Lisa. I'm sorry. I'm not. <laughs> it's the Germans' fault. I'm. Yep. I'm going B. You're going really B. And what was a special B. tax only? Right. I'm. I, okay. I. I'm going to go A because I. Not because Reese said, but I honestly no, think. No, but he does. He hesitated when he was reading, a, and he also he's treacherous. So I'm it going. It can't be a thing for getting a bigger plate of thing. It's so ridiculous. I can't believe I've got to answer these questions while I'm also in danger of crashing into a star. <laughs> honestly. <laughs> All right, so Burr is saying B, uh, Burr is saying no. A. A, yeah. Yes. yeah. A, yeah. Tato is saying B, and Rini, you were doing... And B. B as well. Oh, I'm going to lose. I've got, I've, I've got bad news. It's a, it's a special tax. A! Special tax. And it was the best of three, wasn't it? So that means I win. Yay! <laughs> Star! Oh, we're we still it. have We still have words for the next stream. Oh, we? good. <laughs> yeah, but I, I think at some point we have to look up some more don't we yeah no you don't no it's fine yes we no, do it, it's fine <laughs> i'm gonna have to look google what that cost i'm absolutely astonished what? by the way that i keep winning this <laughs> <laughs> no one's more horrified by the result than i am <laughs> <laughs> oh dear uh, to be honest it's not your linguistic skills but you just know me better. yes yes i yes i don't yeah, listen to true. what i don't listen to what you're saying i listen to how you're saying it yeah do you listen to the pause yes and, like, and i listen to everything either side of it as well yeah and whether i can hear him twirling his moustache do you know what I, I was saying to Bird this morning? I had quite a proud moment this morning over my cup of tea, saying that I managed to make Mr. Primetime Casual make the same, same sound as Bird does on, oh, when, when, we, were, when yeah, we were playing yeah. last night over Reedyisms. Yeah. I heard the same level of despair. Yeah, basically let go. Of, oh God! <laughs> I'm proud of that. That was over postbox, wasn't it? And mail slot, and how you, yep. yeah. I'll get you back, Prime. I'll get you back. Uh, Taylor's saying, uh, the, yeah, Dicot, sorry, Prime's got that. Yeah, I'll, I'll be just quiet. Just two things uh, off there. I'm just actually oh, okay. looking it up as well. Oh, thank you. To give the proper... Good word. Proper definition. Speak <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, Hustle in this case is... Really Hustle love to hate and hate to love, you know. Okay, I like that word. That might be my favourite. So word. when you're when you're making up the um the nonsense, are you making up those nonsense answers, or are you getting this from an online quiz? Make okay. up nonsense no, no, answers. I'm making up. You're making yeah. up nonsense to try and yeah, we upset make us. These up. Okay. I can't believe you both put so much effort into this. Uh, we are German. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. It's German efficiency. Yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> If you do oh, something, do it right. Yeah. Well, there is that. So, oh, sorry, I just got a complete change of subject. Sorry, I just mm. glanced up and saw Barnard's loop. Um, mm. so I've got two accounts. Obviously, I've got my Explorer account as well. And we're we saw Barnard's loop the other day, didn't we, Reenie Regals? Mm -hmm. But it's it's 
Well, on so you'll see on the stream at the moment, it's about yay big. Mm -hmm. um, and where we are with, our, with my other character, it's about yay big, and we're the other side of it. I just, I just love that mm. about buy tives. Uh, yeah, I thought this was boring now because oh. <laughs> it was fucked up. Yeah, I love that. I just love that about this game. It's just, you know. Okay, so is there anywhere in Elite that you don't see Barnard's loop? Oh God, yeah. Oh yeah. Right. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Is it just because we we don't well, see it, for example? Do you know yeah, it? we. Okay. Totally don't see yeah, it. No, it's big, but it's not that it's, big. It's huge. Okay. Yeah, Barnard's Loop is huge. And it also has lots of uh, of permanent locked sectors. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. And it also looks it's remarkably nice. similar. around there with the Witch's Nebula, Witch Head Nebula, what it is. Mm. Really, really difficult. Yeah. Right. And it also looks remarkably similar to the uh, the symbol on the Thargoid. Yeah, that as well. Chips, yes. doesn't it? So you can't tell me that's a coincidence. No. no, it certainly isn't. Everybody break out your tinfoil hat. Uh, yeah. uh, interesting. Oh, yeah, yeah I, I did a bit of uh, tinfoil hattery actually in oh, my blog. Oh yeah, you're doing I'll... you're doing some science, aren't you? I put up tomorrow. Tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, a bit of tinfoil hattery about these uh, permit locked sectors. Oh, brilliant. Okay. Because okay. they're in the middle of nowhere for no apparent reason. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But there has to be, so, what exactly. is the thinking behind the reason? Is there any general thinking behind it? Well, the the the, the official frontier excuse is that they're kept locked for future expandability story wise. I, they, correct me if right. I'm wrong, someone. That's my understanding from what they've said, but I couldn't tell you where I heard that. Okay. But that's why they're yeah they they've got them locked because they want to use them at some point in the future. So obviously one of them's going to be Thargoid space. Got to be. Got to be. Um, but what on what the hell Guardians. else they've got planned? Guardians, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, but what the hell else they've got planned? We do not know. I think AI is probably in the mix somewhere. Hmm. If she looks like Guardian bubble, the um, table chips mm. say. Future Guardian yeah, bubble. That was I was thinking as well. You know, because the <clears throat> uh, the permit lock where. We are currently at Hives and I on Distant Worlds too. Mm. It's a huge area, uh, huge area actually. Um, there's nothing much in it. I think one nebula, right? Ivan mm. said, but it's, it's, it's huge. It's about the size of the bubble or larger. So wow. Okay. It might very well, very, very well be something like that. Five or six hundred light years across, something like that. Yeah. Are they? Do we know if there's any mm. areas of space that are permit locked that aren't centered around nebula? Oh, mm. I don't know. Mm. I wonder Do if you think they are then? What's that? Centered around Nebula. All the, well, all I the would... permit locked areas that I know of at the moment are centered around Nebula. Yeah, but it would make sense to include something like Nebula in, in these sectors. Just to have all features, you know, stellar features. Yeah, there. or are they just the ones we found because we go looking at Nebula? That's what I'm thinking because it's an awfully big galaxy. Yeah, otherwise. that's true. Yeah, do you have a natural inclination to go exploring the nebula? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we find, so we, so we, of interest. so we find someone else is coming in on the left. It's, it's AI, unfortunately. Mm. Mm. Interesting. I don't know where Operation Ida are doing their hauling today. I'm guessing it's in open because they're not in the Operation Ida group. Yeah, because you thought you were going to see people. Yeah. Lincoln, Bravo, uniform, uniform. I think quite a few people are heading into open. Yeah, so do they actually have a priority list in which you know, order these stations should be repaired? Um, well, I was doing some hauling for them about a week or two ago, and um, they did have a... I don't know about priority list for, for stations themselves, I'm not sure about that, but um, they, did, they had a priority list for what they wanted for a particular station. Um, but I've never, I don't, yeah, with regards to what station they're picking up and why. I think when they were when they were doing it down in the Pleiades, I think there was definitely a priority list for what stations because they needed to be able to, you know, buy stuff. And so you've kind of got what you know what's logical to have up and running before everything else, I suppose. But in the bubble, everything's everywhere, isn't it? I would have thought. Yeah. Uh, also, the distance to the Pleiades. Okay, Tato saying most people haul open. Mm, I think they do. It's the impression I've got. But why do they have this private group then? <clears throat> mm. Yeah, that kind of begs the question, really. Mm. I don't know. Give people the option, yeah. I suppose. I don't know. 
because I thought if this was the big uh, Operation Ida weekend, trying to get stations online within 24 hours, mm. I would just use this. Mm. I wonder if they've got another one for it, if this one gets gets repaired really quickly. Landing successful. Clear to disembark. Don't board and uh, Have you made any difference? Wrong station. We've got one more. This is... Um, oh. I've got into the wrong bulletin board as well. Um, yeah, wrong station, so I've just got to pick why, up why some... Why are you looking at missions? Yeah, because I'm an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> I just wanted to... Yeah. Just I wanted to, to point that out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Look what this silly English man did. <laughs> oh, really? Okay. I have fueled. I have definitely fueled. As I say, you fueled, yes. you don't really need to... I went. I deliberately went through before we started the stream today. I deliberately went through my uh, my bookmarks on the mm. Galaxy map because I knew it was going to be streamed, and I didn't want Prime <laughs> getting annoyed at me. <laughs> I saw that. So I went Have through. You tidied it all up? I tidied it all up. All the stuff yeah. that had a a a a a a a a a at the start. <laughs> I, got rid of it. I, I thought he'll get angry with me again, and I just can't be bothered with that. So. <laughs> I like the effect you're having. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it'll, it'll go, if you see this, because you you had a hard enough time when you saw um, my exploration account, and that hasn't got that many bookmarks in it. So I thought if you if you saw the bookmarks for this one before I cleaned it up, oh my god, you would have gone mad. <laughs> <laughs> Of five years worth of nonsense I had to get rid of. Oh god. Yeah. Yeah, Tato is saying you know, open is more safe than people realize, but streaming in a busy system makes you a target. Yes, that's, yes. That's actually a problem. Yes, I'd love to be an open, I really would, but I'm not going to stream and be an open. That's just asking for trouble. Uh, and Liza Tsu is saying historically played open, but I uh, know working on a minor faction and so they are in hiding ah. in a private. Okay. I think that's that's actually quite nice about Elite that all these different modes of play work together in the same. same yeah, case. I know it annoys a lot of people, doesn't it? Yes. I do quite like it. I have to say, although I would I would like the option to, and I know this is going to upset people, but I would like the option to stay in open, but say I don't really want to be bothered with pvp i'd non like to be un open. unattackable by other players i'd like that because i just want to see everyone and i just think it would be nicer to see everyone but that's the option i'd like yeah the thing is even without you know being fired upon in in open in, in pve yeah. um, you still can get you know grieved by people like ramming you into stations or blocking yeah you from, from mm. yeah or something like that. Right. yeah but I, I, under, I do understand both sides of the argument. I really do. But I would very like very hard. Open and then consensual PvP as well. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Tato saying you'll be streaming in open later on. Quick, go get him. Let's get him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It'd be funny if that burp pit crew turned up and wouldn't let him go everywhere. <laughs> That'd be terrible. He'd kill us all in a heartbeat, wouldn't he? Yeah, he would. Yeah. <laughs> Even in a T9, he'd ruin my day. <laughs> It's a shame, really. Mm. It'll be nice to be able to just to see everyone all in one, one yeah. shard, so to speak. Perhaps that's a bit idealistic, but it would be nice. Yeah, mm. never mind. At least we've got options. Options is good. This will be my last run, ladies and gentlemen. Excellent. So, do we see how much you earn for this? And then we will have yeah. tea. If, if you actually, um, if you actually made a difference. Yeah. So it would be interesting, wouldn't it? Frame shift drive charging. You're delivering 750 tons? Uh, about 752 tons, yeah, I believe, yeah. Yeah. You're saying the Seekers of Zen do BGS in open. They've yet to run into any Alliance goons. Hmm. If Liella stops by to swipe, snipe my power plant, that's life. Who's Liella? Liella? Should we know who Liella is? No, I don't. But apparently, they don't like Tato's talk. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> what are you going to be streaming, Tato? Are you going to be doing any 
<clears throat> is this stuff where you just... Ah, uh, PvP friend of his is Liella, okay. Oh, okay. We, we could actually do something like that, you know, mm. a perfect friendly uh, PvP tournament. Yeah. Uh, every, everyone, everybody just buys a uh, stock Sidewinder or yep. something like that. Yeah, and, absolutely. And... That could be quite fun, actually. Yeah, absolutely, yeah. Because yeah. it's cheap and, and you, know, you don't lose anything. You don't need much time to engineer. Just stock something, you know, small ship, completely stock and have a go. Yeah, absolutely. No, that'd be really good fun. Yeah. So what, we basically just try and kill each other? Yeah. Oh, even I tried that. Was, even no, I tried that. <laughs> I think it'll it'll stay with trying. But um, we could oh, do it could around. Be, could you imagine? Near, near yes, I can. Planet, for, How do for I fire me guns? It'll be... <laughs> yeah. Oh, dear. Friendlies go to a whole percentage. Oh, okay. I like yeah, that. Yeah, like you... 10 or something. Okay. Or 50 percent or whatever. You want you agree on something before the duel starts. Nice. Once one of you is at or below that percentage, you stop shooting at each other, and mm. the person has lost. That mm. Mm. that's how it works when uh, gentlemen or women do PvP. That's quite nice. That's quite nice actually. Oh, okay. I just can't imagine Prime stopping if it was me, I'm honestly. Not a gentleman and not a woman? Yeah. No, no I was yeah. going to say, be like, oh, not Can you imagine sorry, if Prime was shooting me and I got down to 50% hole? I go, oh, well done, mate, your game. And he go, yeah, yeah. And we just keep going. When like... <laughs> Standing over my flame, the flaming hulk of my ship, laughing. Oh. <laughs> Right, add that to the list. We're going to do that when you come back. I actually, I actually, I've got. I keep meaning to talk to you too. I've got a, an idea for an event that we can do when you're back. Um, that should be hilarious, and we're doing it in open as well. Which is? No, I'm not going to say on stream. We'll we'll, we'll talk about it afterwards. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Keep it a secret. Mm. Oh, we've got a secret. Yeah. Does it involve shooting prime time? It could potentially. It could <laughs> definitely. Does it involve hitting burn the condo? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Does it involve getting revenge for 66? <laughs> yeah. Revenge for 66. 64. <laughs> oh, Here we go. Jet market one last time. And then we'll have a look at some numbers. Mm, yeah, see so if it made a difference. Nice if it did. Yeah, undoubtedly made a difference. So, <clears throat> I think last time we were at 86% beryllium. Mm, mm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the um. Yeah, and something around thirteen thousand units. Unsurprisingly, okay. the deliveries in going into the uh, Ida <laughs> Discord channel were constant, absolutely constant. So, just yeah, quite you reported nice. your hold on the Discord on the server, didn't you? Yeah, I've done it all of them so far. Yeah. I haven't had to put the um, famous last words. I haven't had to put the baboon on camera this stream so far. That's a first. Don't jinx it now. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, well, but you did a uh, loop of shame. You did do one loop of shame. I did do a loop of shame. That's very true. Oh, I see what you mean. Yeah, Taylor. Yes, Taylor, I did. I've done all of them. Yeah. What's that he said afterwards? I can't see what that is. No. Request approved. Please head directly for bay zero. Two strange images. Can't make them out. Nice. I like all the scaffolding around the boat. Yeah, it's awesome, isn't it? Yeah. And we're going bay two. That's a lot of scaffolding. Attention, Commander. You need to reduce your speed. Do you know where you're parking? Straight yeah, down. Straight down. <laughs> down here. I wish they put the big bays at the back of the station. It's more fun like that. 
Yeah, you would think that the large landing pads are at the back of the station. You would have thought, yeah, it would make sense. Okay, here we go. Right, let's have a look. Docking complete. Perform landing check. See you later, Tato. Yeah, see you later, Tato. Thanks for stopping by, mate. See you, Tato. I'm popping on his stream and see what uh, he gets on later. Yeah, definitely. Go and snipe his power plant. Apparently, that's quite the thing. <laughs> yeah, I'm making about uh, 1,200,000. Yeah, but 000. I want to see you snipe something. <laughs> yeah. Like, well, I couldn't hit, dude, I couldn't hit a planet. <laughs> Let me just do oh, well, my... Well, you if, if you ask your pack hounds nicely, maybe they do it for you. <laughs> yeah. Or you could you could take two ship launched fighters. Oh. 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 Two ship launched Germans. Two ship launched yeah. Germans. <laughs> ship launched Germans. <laughs> Please aim your German directly <laughs> at the table. <laughs> yeah, that'd be so worth it. Uh, all right, let's see some numbers. Come on. Yes. Numbers. Okay. Where are they? Where are they? I can't see anything out that window. Oh, sorry, I had to do my I have to do my my um, Discord thing for Operation Ida. So, okay, okay. there we go. Brilliant's at one hundred percent. Indium's at one hundred percent. Gallium's one hundred percent. Wow. Okay. Tantalum's one hundred percent. That's going quickly. Lithium that's at ninety. Quick. Titanium at one hundred. Aluminium at one hundred. Oh, that's. I think that's they're very good. I think their estimate earlier was way over. That's going to be done in the next couple of hours, surely. That's amazing. Surely. I mean, look at the autofabricators. 300 units missing. That's less That's than a complete hole. Yeah. Uh, lithium as well, like 800. Yeah. Uh, there are wow. that can do that in, in a single hole. So. That's really good. Oh, that's amazing. Yeah, there's, nice. there's like 1,400, 1,500 synthetic fabrics coming just while we've been talking. Really? Yeah, I'm just looking at the at the Discord, mm. yeah. That's amazing. Oh, that's going to well, be I online in no time, isn't it? Thing like this. That's I'll fantastic, isn't it? Twitter to see just how many stations yeah. they can get repaired. Mm. That's amazing. Look at this, look at this. That's incredible. Oh, the other, really let's hope they've got a plan B and that there's another station while well, they've got everyone's attention. That would be yes. really brilliant. I think they have lots of stations to Surely. choose from. 776 auto fabricators just arrived. That's really cool. And a little bit of money for you as well. Yeah, more than a little bit actually. A few yeah. credits. Uh, amazing. Oh, that's brilliant. There you go. Successful. Let's call it there, shall we? Thank you very much, everybody, for stopping by. It was lovely to see you. We must do this again. I'll say thank you very much uh, to Mr. Primetime Casual. You can find his uh, his blogs on YouTube if you look up um, Primetime Casual. He's currently on Distant Worlds and does a... Is it, is it once a week you do those, Prime? Mm. Once a week, yes. Mm, yes. They're very good. Uh, Tyvin does um, a, a textual log, which I have to say, mate, are beautifully written. Mm. Ree's always Extremely remarking. Nice. Yeah, Ree's always remarking on, on the quality of your writing because she... Does a quick edit for you, didn't she? Just they're to make sure. Sort of, you know, they, um, they sort of take you to a place that you're right not, don't they? Mm. Yeah, they're really, really good. If really you're not good. in distant worlds, it, it just gives you a taster, which I, I really enjoy. I really like that every week. Yeah, brilliant. Thank you very much, everybody. This has been huge fun. Well done, fun. Operation Ida. Woo and let's hope there's a plan B and that there's another one. That would be really good to see. And we mm. will do this again next week. See you later yes. on. Bye.